This is it, everybody. The finale of Spider-Man 2 on the PlayStation 5. Thank you for joining along with me the entire way through. If you've enjoyed this series, make sure you stay subscribed to the YouTube channel and like this video so I know that I should play maybe a Venom game or a Wolverine or a future Spider-Man game. So until then, enjoy the finale. You can't miss a moment of the action, everybody. Spider-Man 2 continues to impress on PlayStation 5. And me being your host, Mr. Bricks O'Brien here with a crash couch through the wall. Oh, this is when you know it's getting really real, everybody. This is when you know it's getting really real. This is your last chance to collect resources to upgrade here before the end of the story. Well, let's just make sure my I's are dotted, my T's are crossed, all right? Uh, Miles has some variants to his suits here, so might as well snag those. But uh, kind of, ooh, these are these are sick. Those are sick styles here. But I pretty much have no uh, anything to do. Uh, if I wanted to go back and get all the symbiote stuff, I can, but I'm not gonna. I think I'm pretty good as it is. So it's time to uh, kick back, relax, and enjoy the ride as we get in to the finale of Spider-Man 2 on PlayStation 5. It's been a pleasure and an honor to play this alongside with all of you. And I hope you get a chance to play it for yourself, but uh, this is it, man. What's the plan? Rock. Central Park Reservoir. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere. Adding more and more people to the hive mind. If all those symbiotes get out of Manhattan. Goodbye, Earth. Hello, planet goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? Creating goo, creating symbiotes but it was useless until Harry repaired it. Yeah, and that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it and free everyone connected to the hive mind. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Me. You know, for illustrative purposes. Harry's still Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without... His best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. While I grab the space rock. For illustrative purposes. All right. Fire up the accelerator. No more hive mind. World saved. We all get churros? <laughs> Theoretically. Pete, what Connor said about Harry being too far gone. If you can't save him, are it you won't ready? come to that. You two will be able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. So what are the odds that MJ is going to be playable in the next game? Like a, a spider in hand, a spider woman, spider woman, right? I think it'd be the, the variant, right? Seems pretty practical. So meteorite is somewhere in that thing. So are Harry and his friends. Here, I figured you could use a sonic touch. <sighs> They're just standing there. Menacingly. What are you waiting for? Look, I can't thank you both enough for everything. Oh, come on, bro. We're the spider team. <laughs> Don't anyone forget it? Sit in there and play with your pet rock all night. It's you and me, Harry. Like we always wanted. Here's the 
Here's the thing, though. You're gonna have to catch me first. Story, Watson. You know, what better way? What's that? Dead end? No. What better way to, uh, you know, get rid of the MJ parts of the story than to just make her a spider person, dude? You know? It'd be sweet. Oh, the yellow growths. There we go. Whoever dropped these flares. Whoa. I mean, that would make all the sense in the world, right? They just do that. Oh, they just do that. Are they? Just hang on. Is that like, is that venom? Nope. Get back. There we go. Well, there's no reason to be stealthy, so that's good. They left more than just behind. Yep. 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 We good? Nope. Well, we will be. There we go. This is cool. I should have aimed for the green one first. Nope. Hey, can these people help? No, they're actually stunned. They can't. Never mind. That's a bad idea. Like the meteorites connected to the rest of the hive. Okay. So that's not going to do anything. Just a normal rock. That can also end the world. Technically, it creates a new one with the Venom symbiote things. Symbiotes. Yeah! <laughs> it's just in the backpack chilling. All right. Sure. Sure. Clearly gotta go this way. Just gotta go. Just gotta go. Avoid all the confrontation. Except y'all. All right. Nope. Nope. Well, I don't know where that one other, one other one went. I don't really care. Bye. See you. Nope. Yep. Come on, recharge. Nope. Come on. That's where that other green one went. Okay. Thank you. Good. It's game over. Good. Where's the yellow? Right here. Nope. Just kidding. Right there. There we go. Good. You know, I'm kind of glad I get to play as MJ during this section. As weird as that sounds, you would think it's the least uh, interactive bit, but not. Nah, this is a. Uh, this is kind of great. Sky. Almost out of this hell hole. Yep. Looks like my ex has that chopper. Yep. Avoid all this. There we go. A double wait. No. No. Nope. Thank you. So three shots is what 
uh, destroys any one of them, regardless of the level or implication or anything like that. Come on. There we go. Yeah. Can't get up that way. All right. Well. Ooh, what's this? Was that a hidden one? It felt like a hidden one. But it definitely wasn't. How do I get up there? Oh, there we go. I'm <laughs> like conveniently. Is that a big boy? Yeah, it is. Oh, well, I don't know if my stun can uh, you gotta be kidding me. deal with this. Oh, it can actually. Whoa. All right. No. Oh, and that was an easy one, two situation there. Well, you know, I got a little bit ahead of myself, but it turns out that little pistol right here does more damage. It does more damage seemingly than anything else I got going on. So that's kind of interesting. Even as Spider-Man. That's very spicy. Yep. Oh, it definitely does more damage than like a typical web slinger. Dude. That's kind of incredible here. Look at that. And I don't think uh, headshots do more damage, but... but I'm fast. Whatever. Yep. Big Goomba and a cake. There you go. That did so much damage. You want to help, man? Nah, here. You're not going to help at all. Time to go, Miles. Why doesn't why doesn't You ready? Why doesn't Miles just take MJ? Just take her and go anywhere. Sure, your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry. Harry. Well, that's kind of ironic. This is where we became best friends. Yeah, it is. And now it's where we become brothers. Join us. This is cool, though. Please remember everything we've been through. Nope. 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 Come on. Nope. Don't take a bite of me. Yeah. Kicking our asses for four years. Venom's invulnerable to webs. Noted. Okay. What is he doing? What is that? What is that? What is that? What on earth? Dude. No. Whoa. Okay. Nope. Nope. I accidentally paused there, which caused me to kill over. My bad, everybody. All right. Well, Join us. at least I kind of... Remember everything we've been through. Know what I'm doing here, at least a little bit. Dude. We'll do this. This. There we go. And so there's different situations where you can ring the bell as well, so that's great. But I need to get a little bit up on it here. Yep. Okay, so this is how we move from one platform to the next. Yeah, there we go. Nope. 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 There we go. 
This does nowhere near the same amount of damage you think it does, dude. Dude. I meant to jump away. Come on now. Is that the helicopter trying to get at me here? Every single day after school. Yeah, it is. Nope. Yeah. This is going to require a little bit of intense focus here, so I would appreciate if you just enjoy the nonsense and whatever else. Yeah. Back over to the football field. Let's go, man. You abandoned us while we were fighting for our lives. I was trying to save you. Yep. To us. Basically, you want to use your abilities as often as you can. This is uh, not really an opportunity to use anything else here. That's cool. You want to join us? We know it. Not today, Bucko. Why do you keep fighting us? You're not giving me a choice. Dude, and the green one? Seriously, man. All right. I definitely shouldn't have uh, used up all of my stuff while I could here. Yep. No, really? Seriously? Yep. We can heal up here. Nope. So this is like a... I know you're vulnerable to webs, but... Really? That did nothing either? Come on now. And I have to use those in order to... Do what I have to... I literally... Did the exact thing you didn't want me to. You Goomba. No, really, seriously. Us, after everything we've done for you. Why do you keep fighting us? You're not giving me a choice. Whoa, the symbiote's dropping in. Not working. <laughs> Well, that certainly works. I didn't realize we could do uh, moves like that against Venom. And doing that with the cop car certainly helps, too. Yeah, you really have to use your own uh, symbiote moves there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Nope. Nope. We didn't throw anything away. What are you talking about, dude? Yeah. No. That's not what happened. Relax, dude. Seriously. No. He saved me. Just like I'll save you. That is absolutely not what happened. Oh, Miles replaces. No, you were sick. And there's only so much you can actually do while something like that is happening. You just gotta, you know, takes a little bit of time. It's messing with your head, Harry. You're my best friend. Yeah, do not use those moves on Venom. It does not matter. It does not help at all. You punching and doing this is gonna matter significantly more than anything else. I'm not a thing. I mean, you kind of are a thing, dude. It's kind of 
obnoxious how much of a thing you actually are. It's incredible. For these guys? Uh, I just kind of done for. Is there anything I can do here? Nope. Seems like not right now. Really? Nope. I can't really avoid that, can I? Nope. And I wanted to use that on Venom. Not you. Anything I can do? Anything I can use? Where is the, uh... Really? There's no siren? No nothing? Okay. Stay calm. Think about one at a time. Yeah, I know one at a time, but really? Uh-huh. This is way too confusing, even for me, man. That totally hit Venom and it took off none of his health at all. Really? No? Really? Yeah, there we go. Nope. A little bit of damage here, seriously? Come on, save me. At least a little bit here. And do this. That'll help. One at a time. One at a time. Yeah, recharge everything for me, please. Unbelievably rapidly, please. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Good. Go. Go. Go! Well, that one does a whole lot of damage. I'm not gonna s use up any more. Nope. I know I need a dodge to get out of the way on that one. But give me a second. That's new. That that's new. That's that's new as far as I know. I think the goo aliens are mad we took their stuff. Yeah, well, they started it. That's very new. Let's get this to the accelerator. Oh, I forgot this is what we have to do. I'm like what? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, no. Dude. 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 That's the thing of nightmares, dude. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. No shot. Force lightning against a venom with multiple. With a flying venom, dude. It's unbelievably crazy. 
crazy, dude. Yep. Yeah. Nope. Yep. There we go. Butterfly in the sky. You can go twice as high. Do do do. Do 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 do. Nope. It doesn't matter. Nope. Oh man, Miles is kicking some butt. Let's go. Like this. We'll do this. I forgot Miles was on a bit of a recharge with this stuff. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. Nope. Nope. Come on. Right here. Boom. Dude, Miles, I annihilated him. This is it. This is it. Nope. You're doing this for yourself. Right here. I forgot that doesn't actually affect him. Nope. No, sir. No, sir. Where are we going? Nope. Yeah. There we go. You took him away from us. Did no such thing, man. No such thing. Nope. Nope. Come on. Don't gnaw my head off. I'm not we remember what you Craven. Harry! Man, that's the symbiote talking, not you! Right here. Bam! You pushed us apart. Bam! Right here. Bam! The force lightning. Come on. You think you're better than us? Don't yeah. This ain't about who's better. I just prefer you without the psycho alien on. <laughs> I mean, true, right? Like, that's essentially all he cares about. Let's end this. Right here.
Yeah! 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 Get him! Time? No, we don't. It'll kill them. Then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together.
here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's good. That's really good. That's really, really, really good. That is amazing. That is amazing Harry pulse is weak we gotta move what have you done what have you done to him I'm sorry I'm coming with you wait traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive. Get the G serum ready. ASAP. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, Cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? What if it no longer exists? Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. But 
what about you? In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. What's the difference between it's wheat okay. cakes, pancakes, nice. and flapjacks? Uh, nice. <laughs> I don't know. I know there was a difference. In a minute, I want to show you something first. Okay. Wheat yeah, cakes. Glasses in it. It does. Yum, oh. I'll take those. <laughs> That's weird. It's very okay. Thanks again for the donation, Peter. <laughs> it's a brand new car. Talk to Miles about not yet. <sighs> you ready? Uh, Miles, I I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about something. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you all, all the time. It's 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 great uh, to talk. So many good talks. I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you, are you sure? It's, it's a big city. I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. Maybe not now, but there'll come a time. I'm here for you, always. Hey, bro. See you. He'll be Peter Parker uh, through the intermediate uh, Venom spinoff game. And then uh, just in time for Spider-Man 3. So uh, that was Spider-Man 2 on PlayStation 5, everybody. Normally during the credits here, as we appreciate all the people that uh, work so diligently on this game, I like to talk about the game and my uh, give my opinions on it. It, it took me a minute to kind of get through everything. Um, but this game is excellent, just like the first game. The second one here uh, takes everything that the first game did, cranks it up to a thousand and beyond. Um, this game, more so than any game I've played on PlayStation 5, really takes the power of PS5 and uses it properly by like taking you into different dimensions very quickly, not just for the sake of showing it off, kind of like what they did in Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart, but also for the sake of the story and telling something meaningful with it, which is what takes a little bit of time right because this came out what the playstation 4 5 
sorry, came out in 2020. So it took four years for me to feel like they made use of this technology in a meaningful way. And uh, it just shows that Insomniac, Sony have a, a, a wonderful franchise and a, a series of characters people really care about and want to see more of constantly, like every single year, having something of some kind. And uh, we might not be getting that because these games take hundreds of millions of dollars to develop. The technology is always changing. There's going to be new consoles, new everything, right? But uh, it's worth the wait for sure. And uh, this is a lot to chew on for replayability and all that. They did a wonderful job, as you're seeing through here, like showcasing all the villains. We basically missed out on Spider-Man 1, highlighting them in very different ways. We get some new developments for characters like Martin Lee, which I was definitely absolutely not expecting at all. And and just making making a lot of use of the environment with the city, adding on to it a little bit more, just enough to justify everything and uh, making Venom a worthwhile character to uh, to have as part of this universe now. So, like I said, the rumor is like, hey, you know, you're going to be able to play as Venom in like this like spinoff game or whatever it's going to be, right? Now, that's obviously just rumors or whatever. There's no information, like, for sure, for sure. But, I mean, until we see this, like, post-credit thing, right? Um, we don't know. I don't I don't know how. You know, uh, Harry's clearly in a coma. And Norman is going to give him what I was giving you that look for, which was the, uh, the Goblin Serum, the G Serum. And we're going to get Green Goblin most assuredly in the next game. We didn't get it in this game. We are, I, I would bet, a lot of money that uh, we're going to get that in the uh, the next game here or or some development of it or whatever. Um, they did a great job having Miles be a meaningful part of the story. Even if you didn't play Spider-Man Miles Morales, you still got an idea of like, you know, what his origin is, why he why he's so involved and uh, why he cares so much, you know, um, every bit of it. It just is an enjoyable story and and it is worth playing, too. So you you were watching me play this and it's it's worth it to experience it for yourself you get to play all the different side missions and you know get to get to really experience all of the different mechanics for the battle system it's worth it so i really didn't make good use of everything admittedly a lot of it feels like still uh spamming one button to kind of get everything done but that is not the case if you know the combos and the systems and and all the different gadgets you have at your disposal, you can make this like as articulate as you want it to be or as simple as you want it to be. You can enjoy it for the story or you can have the highest difficulty and challenge yourself the entire way through. Whatever you want to do, you can do it. And it's very worth it. If you get the deluxe edition, you get the standard edition, whatever it is, like it's just, it's just straight up worth it. And they're telling such a great story and a great Venom story that no movie, uh, current or previous has even come close to doing and it would be a very long time before we get a a meaningful venom story like this so very successfully had the groundwork in spider-man one through to miles morales and now this game here and uh craven was an excellent villain man him getting his head bitten off was just uh, <laughs> cool very, very good and this part too with the wings dude crazy crazy stuff so i'm glad i didn't get spoiled by uh, anybody at all uh, the entire time that this game has been out and uh, i look forward to playing anything that, that comes out of this uh the next game should be wolverine that's what we know about officially as of right now but uh that one i will not be playing for videos at all but uh spider-man 3 eventually but for now that is spider-man 2 will we get a post credit scene it's almost a tradition man give us a little something yeah of course of co you can have of course of course I'm assembling a team of six individual characters. Right? I need five. Docky! <laughs> Docky! Hey, man. What do you want? The Spider Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. Mm. 
they didn't they actually they saved him your if your cameras could have told that actually you have the cameras in the good we all have to experience loss even you norman wow that is metal what are you writing the final chapter that's <laughs> That means nothing. That so means nothing. That means nothing. That means nothing. That literally means nothing. All right. Well, uh, let's see what. Uh, what do we got, man? Hey, man. Hey, Miles. Hey, man. Is that uh, Haley for a date? It definitely is. Because you're looking at his fit. Got to make fit, fit check. Look at that. See? Look at that. Good for him, man. Haley, hi. I hope you're hungry. Starving. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. <laughs> <laughs> can't I can't believe I did it's the Puerto Rican flag not the American flag I'm such a so what's this about some guy in Harlem probably seen him volunteering in the city helping out his city council mom and trying to live up to his hero dad I like that version of that person. Yeah. You're not wearing your suit. It's got like liquid cooling. It's kind of sick. Wait, because it's electricity that is liquid. Wow. To regulate his body temperature. Wow. Tell me it's Norman. Come on. Hi. Miles, Haley. This is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to oh. meet you. <laughs> oh, and uh, this is my daughter, Cindy. So it's clearly a character we should know about. Um, cool. Let's just look this up real quick. That is silk. Cindy Moon is silk. I guess we'll find out. You finished the main story, but both Peter and Miles are still available to continue the adventure. You can start fresh on the ultimate difficulty. Good luck, hero. Uh, no, uh, I'm going to go do something else, like go make myself dinner and uh, enjoy uh, a little bit of free roam here while we wait for Spider-Man 3 or... Spider-Man Venom, which is that's an awful Venom voice, but you get the idea. Thank you for joining me through this entire journey here and bearing with my delays in getting this out. But now that this is in the books, we got 2024 to look forward to. And who knows what else that means? Thank you for listening, watching, tuning in and meowing it out with me as always. I'll see you again next time for more Spider-Man adventures eventually or what's going to happen more likely and very, very soon. Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. Talk to you soon. Bye.